Hey guys, what's up? Today is Vlog Saturday. If you don't know me, my name is Sarah, and you've stumbled upon the most amazing vlog on YouTube. So lucky you. Um, if you didn't see the Facebook like page for the SNEC channel, um, I have an awesome announcement that instead of waiting to the very end of the video, I'm gonna tell you now. But first, if you haven't liked the like page yet, there's a link down in the skirt. So do that, like, after the vlog, because you don't want to miss all of this awesomeness. Um, so the girls and I kind of got together, and right now we have a, a music video under construction. Um, <laughs> it's a bit of a mess right now, but it's all good. It'll come out all good. And then... Another girl is actually working on her very own song, so shout out to them. I'm not giving any names because that would ruin the fun, and I like fun not to be ruined. So yay! So summer's kind of basically over, and that's really depressing. Um, last year I gave advice to the incoming freshmen, so this year I'm giving advice to the sophomores. The friends that you had last year aren't going to be your friends this year. A few of them might stay, but most likely a lot of them will go away. All of your classes are going to be a lot harder because the teachers expect way more from you. You are still a sophomore, so know your place, but you're a sophomore, so you know, you get to tease freshmen, so that's a bonus. You are one more year closer to going to college. So college is actually a real thought now. You get to choose those awesome electives. Don't be afraid to try new things. Honestly, sophomore year is the worst high school year ever. Get yourself organized and don't procrastinate as much. A bonus for this year being the worst year of your life you're probably turning 16, which means you'll be able to get your temps, which means you'll be able to drive. And unfortunately, the PSAT and the ACT are a real thing. Silver bells! Woohoohoo! Help out the freshmen. Like, seriously, help them out. They're gonna need it. But like I said, you're still a sophomore, so when you do help them out, get, you know, tease them a little bit. Make sure you always have a plan A, B, C, D. Basically just have a plan for all of the letters in the alphabet because you will fail and screw up and mess up over and over and over again. Your school schedule is probably gonna suck. Um, most likely they're gonna have your two hardest classes back to back with each other and you probably aren't gonna have a lot of lunches with your actual friends. Stress, but don't overstress. One thing that I'm really upset that I didn't do is when extra credit was offered, I didn't take it. So sophomores, take the extra credit opportunities. Remember, this is really, really, really important. Like, you have to remember this. This year's incoming freshmen were not born in the 90s. You are the last 90s class sophomores. Do not read your notes for studying. During your study halls um, at NDA, do not play your music extremely loud because it's really, really annoying. And, you know, you might be able to, you know, chill with your music really loud, but that person sitting across the hall from you or across the room for you is hearing that and they're not being, they can't study. And, Lastly, remember at the end of the day that you are so freaking awesome and fantastic. There you have it. So, if you like this video, make sure you like it. If you want to subscribe, which I know you do, click that red button. If you have a comment, comment down in the skirt. And as always, I will see you next Saturday. Dream on. Bye!